Bricklink Designer Program Crowdfunding Part 2. That's what we're discovering today, guys. What's up, everyone? Stud City here. Before we jump into today's video, do me a huge favor, smash that like button and subscribe. We're nearing 4K subscribers, and I think that's awesome. But without further ado, let's jump straight into today's video. So we're recently talking and brought aware of the crowdfunding for all the BrickLink LEGO idea set. For those of you who don't know, these are idea sets that hit 10,000 votes but did not make the passing by the LEGO team. So BrickLink is offering us a chance to buy these awesome sets. Now, I do think there's a great selection, but for example, the Lego store, which has 2,149 parts with a retail price of $180 with free shipping, of course. I'm comparing this to the Lego official Lego set, which is the modular from 2019. Uh, the book shop i'm sorry 2020 but it's the bookshop which has 2504 pieces now i'm just doing apples to apples right because they're both modulars the lego store that we just saw was a modular i'm just comparing it is it worth it compared to an official lego set that i'm not sure of as you can see at the time of recording there was around 5,000 copies sold so that is one thing to think about but taking a look at some of the other ones like the venetian houses i think they're absolutely fantastic uh, I think it's a great looking set, but a retail price of $290 is just too steep in my books uh, for this BrickLink par out set. That's just my opinion. I do think they all look so amazing, right? This Lego store modular, it looks great, right? Uh, I, I do believe so, but I think the price point is just too much. Uh, I think this one is my favorite, the Bowling Alley. Uh, still a high retail price, but this one, in, in my opinion, has the best overall interior. Uh, and again, as of recording this, there's four projects that are fully funded. So these will be for sure purchased uh, for those of you who have bought. We're still anticipating one more to cover the 3000 mark. So we'll see when that comes out. But this video was intended to get some inspiration from you guys. I want to hear your thoughts and opinions on the BrickLink Designer Program and the projects that's just released because I am very intrigued. So do comment below on your thoughts uh, as I've told you mine. And uh, thanks for watching. We'll see you in the next video. Stud City out.